Let's take a super common chord progression like a 2-5-1 in C major, like this. D minor 7, G9, C major 7. If I look only at the top notes, the top note of the D minor 7 is an A, the top note of the G9 is an A again, and the top note of the C major 7 is a G. That's okay, but we can do better. What if instead of playing A, A, G, we play A, A flat, G. It would be smoother. So here I'm putting the A on top on the G9. Instead, I'm, I'm putting this A flat on top and then I'm playing the G in the C major 7. The resulting chord here, it's a G flat 9, G7 flat 9, which is a super common chord in jazz. And you can hear that it's much smoother. We could also do something different, we could go up. So we have an A on the D minor 9, we could put this uh, A sharp for the G, creating a G sharp 9, and then we can keep going with the motion having a top note of B, which is the 7th of the C major 7, so I get this. And this is how you spice up your jazz chords.